Welcome to boardshop.co.uk, surfboard review time. The children want me to say this, can you please hit the, red, hit the red button in the corner of the screen to subscribe to our YouTube channel, whatever. Love Machine Surfboards, apparently named after the 90s song by Pop Combo Wham, but I can't confirm that. Um, this is the FM model. There's a lot going on here. Um, so let's start at the beginning. It's a mid-length, obviously but it's a mid-length of the difference. Yes, you get the paddle power, the cruise, all that stuff, but Ryan Lovelace has thrown in a load of other crazy features to give you a more responsive feel and to give you a board that um, creates speed out of thin air, just like that, even in slow or weak waves. So, here it is, moderate rocker. Um, it's kind of trademark dome deck so it smuggles a lot of volume in through the middle of the board, wide point nice and far forward, and that's what gives you the paddle power. But to give you the performance and the rail to rail transfer speed, the board domes down into the rails, and the rails are pretty hard actually, they're pretty pinched through the middle of the board, uh, and they harden up even more into the tail, but they're soft up into the nose. So what that means is you get turning from the middle of the board, you don't have to have your foot jammed over the fins to make it work, the board turns from the middle, goes rail to rail, transfers nicely. And with that ability to keep the speed up, it means you can push your turns quite hard, so you get a really manoeuvrable, really responsive ride. Now, the interesting bits. On the base here, there's further definition to the rail. There's more volume here, and then it pinches down into the rail. So again, this flat section across from rail to rail gives you that speed and glide, but where it pulls down into the rail, and it's pretty pinched, pretty hard rail for a mid-length board. Um, that's what gives you that maneuverability. <laughs> right back here into this little Bonza fin setup, um, the rail hardens right up, and then you've got this crazy curved channel, which is there for good reason. Uh, <clears throat> Lovelace describes how when you put this kind of V through the back of a board, the board wants to stick to the face of the wave, and so it doesn't release very easily. And what these channels are here to do is to disrupt the flow of water to get the board to release. <clears throat> it's something that's been done before with channels by other, other shapers, but with this curved channel, he does it in a different way to make the release immediate as soon as you change your weight from side to side on the board. So that's what gives it its rail to rail speed um, transfer, but also gives it that loose feel and that maneuverable feel. Um, the fin setup is a bespoke <coughs> twin with this little bonzer on the outer, and the outer little nubstiff type fin is there again to break up the flow of water onto the bigger fin to give you that looseness and that maneuverability. It's a pretty crazy looking thing, a nutter of a surfboard, but it absolutely works. <coughs> um, so if you're looking for a mid, for anything from thigh high to overhead, and you want a bit more than what the standard mid gives you, i.e. in terms of performance and maneuverability, the FM is something that you need to look into and dig a bit deeper and see if it's gonna work for you. It's the most popular board in the Lovelace range um, in, the, in regards to the mids, and it absolutely flies. Two of the boys here have already ordered them. Uh, one's already surfed it, and he absolutely loves it. If you surf to CI mid, um, Pizel mid length crisis, all those other kind of things, this kind of board is gonna give you that extra dimension of performance and usability in a wide range of waves. Um, some mids are more suited as a step up type thing. Some are more suited with very flat rockers to smaller, weaker waves. But the FM basically nails it top to bottom. Um, so if you're looking for that all-rounder in a mid, um, <clears throat> you want a bit of length for paddle speed and what have you, check out the Royal Lovelace FM because it is a genius creation. Um, they're online now. Buy on finance, trade-ins, all that good stuff. Any questions, just give us a shout and hit that red button, please.